on the ninth day of novena let us walk with claudine to build bridges with gratitude give thanks in all circumstances for this is the will of god in christ jesus for you 1 Thessalonians chapter 5 verse 18 What is gratitude? Gratitude is a positive divine attitude. It's about being grateful to God and thankful for the blessing of life. For Claudine, gratitude was just this. How good God is. She was the manifestation of God's goodness. And that's why her last words were How good God is. With her last words, she built the bridge of gratitude to God. On Wednesday, 1st February During one of her lucid moments the nuns who had been with her heard her pronounce very clearly with an accent of love as one of them put it how good god is when she uttered these words there was such a conviction in her voice such a radiance in her face that those who witnessed the scene were never to forget it how good god is these were the last words of the foundress she never spoke again yes she had experienced the goodness of god and it was her ardent desire that all souls come to know this loving god 2 days later on 3rd february 1837 the first friday of the month at 3 o'clock in the afternoon the foundress passed away peacefully the foundress was deeply mourned by nuns orphans relations friends and acquaintances from every walk of life all felt that they had lost a mother a counselor a sincere loyal and true friend they came to spend a final moment with her as she lay in the chapel She did not have the joy of seeing completed and her mortal remains were carried to Loya Cemetery accompanied by a long procession of relatives and friends Father Ray delivered the funeral oration his well chosen words did justice to her virtues From heaven the foundress looks down with love on her religious family did she not say a superior is still one when she is in heaven the truest homage that her spiritual daughters could render their beloved foundress is to carry on the work with fidelity and be true to the spirit of their foundress prayer father claudine experienced your goodness throughout her life be gracious to us and let us also taste your goodness and love as we journey together in this our earthly pilgrimage May our hearts know your goodness 
and like Claudine, may our last words be, how good God is. Through the intercession of Saint Claudine, we pray for gratitude that we may live gratitude-driven lives and make a difference in the world. As we pray, God our Father, you granted Saint Claudine Thevenet an intimate experience of your merciful goodness and you called her to dedicate her life to the education of the young, giving her the grace to draw from the heart of your son an ardent zeal to make Jesus and Mary known and loved. Help us, like her, to be witnesses to your love, given over to the action of the Spirit and open to the needs of our brothers and sisters, especially the most deprived. Grant us through her intercession and for the praise of your glory and the grace for which we now pray. Saint Claudine Thévenet, pray for us.